welcome all. Today I'll be showing you how to import your existing ebooks into iTunes for use on your iPhone or iPad. Um, now the first thing you're going to have to do to, to get this to, to work is to actually download the iBooks application. Um, if you already have uh, either a 3G or 3GS phone, it doesn't come automatic. All new iPads, of course, do have it there. Uh, if you don't know where to get it, you can just pop on. I, uh, the iTunes section of the Apple Store. Just Google it. You can find it, of course, in the App Store on both your iPhone and your iPad. Now, if you've gone ahead and downloaded this on your iPhone or iPad, you do have to plug it in just to get it to sync up. Reason being is it adds a nifty little icon right here saying Books. Um, once you have the Books icon, it's pretty simple. Um, all you have to do is locate where your existing uh, ebook is, so whether you've downloaded it from Google, because I know they've added a whole bunch of new books for people to check out, um, whether it's uh, from the, uh, the Kindle, or whatever other device you have. Uh, mine right here is just sitting on the, uh, the desktop, uh, falling free, fantasy book. Uh, this is the real tricky part. All you have to do is just click and drag. Um, iTunes will import it. Uh, it will unpack uh, any of the data if it is there, so uh, if it does have chapters, it'll break that apart for you. Um, book art is right there, as we can see on this one here. Um, and that's about it. Uh, once you've done this, uh, all you have to do is just click and uh, drag it right onto your device, whether it be your iPhone or your iPad, or you can just do a simple uh, you know, sync device and it'll you know, just simply add everything on. Uh, so if you have any questions uh, about this process, just feel free to, to add it into the comments. And thanks for listening. Bye now.